Rishi uh, Shekhar Shukla, student of class 12. And I have pursued the two year classroom program from the Akash Mayatnagar branch. So it, I'm very proud of myself and I'm amazed that I have scored uh, full marks that is 300 by 300 in the JMA's 2024 examination. And uh, this has been my interest since uh, very beginning. And since the childhood, I have been giving various Olympiads, for example, those conducted by SOF. And mm -hmm. uh, also I've given the NHTSC conducted by the Unified Council. And these exams are conducted on the national level and they have helped me to stay motivated throughout my journey. And this is my aim in these national examinations was to stay at the top and to work harder so that I could uh, achieve a good rank in, at the national level. So this played a very important role in my motivation. And uh, Akash had already provided me with the targets, the materials. And uh, these materials were more than sufficient and more than enough to crack the entire examination. And I feel that uh, the faculty members were too cooperative. They interacted with me, they cleared my doubts and uh, they helped me in every way that was possible, almost yes. So I am uh, very satisfied with them and uh, they have all helped me throughout. And Akash had also played a very big role. By They have provided various tests such as the FTS and the archive tests. And uh, my parents are working as scientists in his role. So okay. my father was also scientist, as a scientist and my mother was a scientist. She had designed and left a job to take care of me and my brother. So this sacrifice of hers has also motivated me to a very large extent. Very good, very good. And you, do you have any siblings? Or you are the only Yes, ma'am, yes, ma'am. I have a brother. He's in class 10 and he's about to come into class 11. Okay, okay. You must be an inspiration for him also. Yes, ma'am, sure. That's uh, good. So, yeah. Uh, so, which board you have studied and uh, like, as you told, you are, you are having a coaching from uh, Akash. Yes, so ma'am. Which I'm board you have board, CBSC board in Pallavi Model School, Alwan. Okay. Okay. So your board. Okay. Your board will be starting from 15th of Feb, right? Uh, 22nd of Feb. 22nd of Feb. Yes, okay. And um, are you completely prepared for? Yes, ma'am. Uh, I, have, I have studied it throughout the year, but now I have to focus on revising the concepts. Okay. So is there any difficulty uh, you face while preparing for boards and entrance exam simultaneously? Uh, not as such, ma'am, because uh, the syllabus for the physics, chemistry and the maths part of the board is exactly the same as almost the same as for the JMAs. So my JMAs preparation almost helped me at about, around 80 to 90 percent for these subjects. And uh, the remaining two subjects are English and physical education that I have opted for for my boards. And uh, throughout the year, I have studied the various chapters and my syllabus is almost entirely over. So now I'm only focusing on revision. So it has been relatively easy to uh, cope up with the boards along with my J preparation. Okay, very good. And uh, what about your preparation? Like when did you started your preparation? How you prepared for it? Can you uh, give a brief about your preparation strategy? Yes, ma'am. Uh, I started my preparation uh, when since the late part of my class 10 as I had entered into class 11. Since then I had joined Akash Institute. And my preparation strategy plan included uh, studying three hours per subject per day. So I used to give the first three hours for maths, the next three hours for physics, and the next three hours for chemistry in this sequence. So I used to study nine hours per day. And uh, I am totally against late night studies. I dislike that because they affect our sleep and our health as well. Okay. And is your, this preparation strategy is different from the last month preparation strategy? Like how you prepared after knowing the syllabus is reduced? Yes, ma'am. After the syllabus was reduced, Akash introduced the uh, two test series. Uh, one was the final test series and then next was the archive test series. So mm -hmm. the, the whole month we had these test series and they helped me to gain uh, complete confidence and uh, over the exam. Uh, they covered an extensive variety of questions and gave exposure to a large number of concepts. And overall, these have helped me to boost my preparation for in the last months, these two test series. Okay. So uh, have you? Uh, how much is... Uh... Last year, previous year questions and sample papers are helpful in your preparation. Have you given mock test and other stuff? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. In Akash, we have uh, monthly, monthly, uh, monthly chapter wise tests. So these were my mock tests. And in the end, as I mentioned, the FTS and the archive test series served as full syllabus mock tests as per the new reduced syllabus of the JMA 2024. And PYQs were already covered in the archive test series. And these are very important. I would recommend anyone studying for JE to necessarily go through these PYQs. Because not only we gain an idea about how the questions are being asked, uh, we also come to know about the pattern of the questions and the level and the difficulty level so that accordingly we can prepare. 
ओके ओके सो विच लाइक विच डे ऑफ द जे मेन यू अपियर फॉर विच शिफ्ट यू आर यू अपियर एंड डू यू फेस एनी प्रॉब्लम इन वाइल गिविंग दी ऑनलाइन एग्जामिनेशन Uh, I appeared on twenty seven January's first shift examination, and uh, there was no problem in giving the online exam because uh, Akash had already familiarized me very much with this computer based mode of test that is going on since the last ten or fifteen years. Okay, and uh, what is the key important points uh, behind your success? Do you, what do you think uh, helped you in succeeding the JEE main exam? Uh, uh, as we already know that practice is something that makes a man perfect. So no doubt, practice, hard work, and uh, dedication, determination will help us. Also, my mother's sacrifice of her job served as a very strong motivation for me to work ahead, to move ahead in my uh, J journey. And the other support from Akash also helped me to maintain consistency in my dedication and hard work. So I would say maintaining consistency in hard work and uh, keeping patience and sheer determination. Will always fetch the results, and this is what uh, we must possess for any competitive examination. Okay, and also uh, help me with the uh, de-stress uh, exercise and practices you are doing to stay motivated during the preparation session. Do you uh, yes, have any yes, de-stressing yes. activities? Yeah. Yes, ma'am. I use various de-stressing activities like uh, listening to soft music, sometimes going for. A walk, say one or five, one kilometer or five hundred meters around my house, and uh, sometimes I would used to practice breathing exercises, some yoga asanas like meditation and pranayama. So these help me to control my emotions and uh, limited my stress levels. So I used to calm down using these exercises. Okay, okay, that's really great. And uh, do you want to give any tips to the upcoming uh, aspirants you for the next sessions? Yes, ma'am. Uh, that tips would be like to stay focused. continue working hard stay determined and never feel uh, this not confident feel that you are very confident of yourself and maintain the motivation throughout also have patience determination and motivation and practice will help us to move ahead in our lives so these these points once they are followed thoroughly they will certainly fetch us good results so i would suggest all of the upcoming students to follow these advice Thank you thanks a lot Rishi for connecting with us and very much congratulations once again Thank you, uh, thanks thanks for uh, interviewing with us thank you thank you ma'am